Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Patrice Medina and I'm running for student council. This election presents us all with a clear choice. It is a choice of team continuing things the way they have always been done or electing leaders who can bring fresh ideas and perspectives. I believe that my experience and personality will help me offer new ideas. Above all, I believe my most important job will be to listen to you and communicate with you regularly. This morning I'm asking for your vote. Here's, here's an idea I believe we can achieve together. One thing we could possibly talk about is have free cart every day. I feel like we should do this, this sorry, this because some kids are not allowed to bring snacks to school. Also in the morning, a lot of kids do not eat their fruit, which means we can save it and possibly do fruit cart every day. As you can see, the future depends on our ability to work together. Cooperation and teamwork will get us far. If you elect me as your student council, I will to lead with openness and honesty. I will lead with your best interests in mind. I welcome all of your ideas for making our school better. I know voting for someone requires a lot of trust, and I'm willing to work hard every day to earn your trust. I humbly ask this morning for your vote. Together we can achieve great things. Thank you for listening. Hello, my name is Kieran. I am a seventh grader, and my home and teacher is Ms. Krieger. I am running for vice president because I want to help my fellow peers. I relate to a lot of the people at this school, whether it be present day me or past me. I used to be really quiet and I was bullied a lot at my old school, but as I started to get older, I started to gain more confidence and make a lot of great friends. I relate to feeling inferior to other people and feeling the need to compare myself with others because I didn't appreciate who I am. I know that there are a lot of people who struggle with anxiety, depression, and other things. I am here to help. I have gone through a lot of things and I understand how a lot of you feel feel and I want to help as much as I can. There are some people who feel like their opinions don't matter, that they won't be listened to or nothing will get solved. I'm here to try and put a change to that. I want to be the voice of my fellow peers who don't feel like they have a voice and want one. I struggle with confidence still and being a vice president is stepping way into my challenge zone. I would be learning, I would be learning a lot of new things as a vice president and I love helping people because at a time when I didn't have friends, some kids stepped up and helped me. They helped me gain a lot of confidence, happiness, and feeling like I finally mattered. I want to help because I know how it feels to not have help and to be ner too nervous or scared to ask for it. I want everyone in the school to experience feeling what I have been lucky enough to feel. I love putting smiles on people's faces and making people laugh. I love helping people realize that they belong and are great people. I want to help everyone at the school with any problems, whether it be bullying, school, work, or even just wanting someone to hang out with. I want you guys to know that you matter, and if, if you believe in yourself, anything can happen. Hello, my name is Hayden Corrales. I have been going to this school since I was five years old, and I believe that giving back to the school that raised me is something I should do. I am a student in Mr. Gagnon's homeroom, and I am running for vice president. I think I am a good candidate because I am a natural leader, I am determined, and I want to help my community. I want to do my part to, mold, to help the school that molds young minds. Since I've reached my last two years at this school, I am going to be the best student as well as the best role model. One of the changes I wish to make are more fundraisers and events available for students. I also wish to create a safer and cleaner environment for students to learn and grow. I wish to make learning more enjoyable for every student and provide the best possible space needed for every individual to learn. And I want everyone to be confident in themselves. Another change I would like to make is I want this school to have a place where students can be themselves without being put down and bullied, which I have had to deal with with this school in the past. I want to make this a place where anyone can enjoy themselves. These are the reasons I believe you should vote me Hayden Corrales for Vice President. Good morning. Good morning, Aikwan. I'm Epstein Kennedal, a seventh grader running for the position of Vice President. So my daily hobbies are drawing and playing sports. I play softball, basketball competitively, and some volleyball for fun. My favorite color is green. I have developed a huge love for cats and ferrets. I feel I'm qualified for Vice President because I am a great listener and problem solver. In addition, I would make a wonderful vice president since I've developed noble leadership skills playing as point guard for basketball and a catcher for softball. And I've also acquired many student of the month awards. And during this ceremony, I have received a reward. 
I volunteer for the community and I will soon work on a farm filled with loving people. Vice President is the right role for me. I want the position of Vice President because of my love for sports and participating in the school's extracurricular activities. I will help provide the school with more school supplies and better sports equipment. That's all, <laughs> sorry. Let's all help Acorn Sports teams become the champions. Go Acorn! My name is Lupita Lugoyola. I'm in eighth grade and I'm ready for <laughs> Of the student council, I am very good at using money wisely. If given the opportunity to be your representative, I will try and use your, the, bu the budget in a wise manner in which we all save money and have lots left. I want to be treasurer because it's a great way to improve my own planning, communication, and financial management skills. If you vote for me, I plan to make the school more fun and exciting. Vote for me so the school year will be filled with those moments that will take your breath away. With my experience and passion, I believe I could be a great leader. I have always been responsible and, and make and I'm good at helping my schedule straight even with, the, with a lot of things going on. So you can rely on me to do my duty as treasurer. I will make sure tre being treasurer is my main priority. Remember, look with that for treasure. Ladies and gentlemen, fellow students and esteemed faculty, I am Gavin West and I've been here at Akron for almost six years now and I stand before you today as a candidate for the position of student council president and I would like to share like to share with you why I believe I am an ideal choice for this crucial role. First and foremost, I am deeply committed to our school and our collective well-being throughout my time here. I have actively participated in very clu various clubs, events, and community service projects. I have witnessed the potential for positive change in lives within our, our student body, and I am dedicated to harnessing the potential for the benefit of us all. Furthermore, I have a proven track record of our leadership. I have held leadership positions in both academic and extracurricular activities, demonstrating my ability to organize, inspire, and lead teams effectively. I believe that effective leadership is about listening to, con the, con to the concerns and ideas of others, and I am committed to being an approachable and receptive leader of who prioritizes the voices of our student body. I am also passionate about promoting in inclusivity and diversity within our school community. I will work tirelessly to ensure that every student feels heard, valued, and represented. By fostering an inclusive environment, we can, we can create a stronger, more united student body capable of achieving remarkable things. Good morning, everyone. My name is Michaela, and I would like to share with you my Ladies and gentlemen, fellow students, faculty, and staff, today I stand before you as a dedicated candidate for the esteemed position of Student Council President. It is an honor to address you and express my vision for our school and the incredible potential that lies within our collective power. I believe that together we can shape a student council that not only listens but truly represents each and every one of us. My fellow students, I envision a student council that is founded on the principles of inclusivity, representation, and unity. I firmly believe that our student council our student body is a diverse tapestry of talent, dreams, and aspiration. It is our duty to ensure everyone has a voice. As student council president, I promise to be that voice for all of you and advocate for the concerns and interests of every student. First, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to emphasize the importance of fostering an environment that encourages personal growth. I will work tirelessly to expand existing clubs and organizations as well as introduce new ones and ca that cater to a wide range of interests. Whether you are passionate about art, science, sports, animal, or activism, I promise to provide ample opportunities for every student to explore their passions and flourish. Additionally, mental health is an issue that deserves our utmost attention. While academics are undoubtedly crucial, it is, a, is, it is in, equally important to prioritize students' well-beings. As someone with learning disabilities, I understand how hard it is for some of us. As your student council president, I will collaborate with the student body, administration, and mental health professionals to implement programs in it, and in activities to support and... Hold on, I lost my spot. Destigmatize mental health challenges. Let us create a safe and nurturing environment to ensure that ensures every student has access to the resources they need to thrive. Furthermore, I will establish an open door policy that welcomes your ideas, concerns, and suggestions. Your voice matters, and as your president, I am committed to imitating constructive dialogue between students, faculty, and administration. Accountabil Transparency and accountability are the cornerstones of effective student leadership, and I will consistently communicate my progress and solicit your feedback. 
Lastly, I want to highlight the power of unity. Our school thrives when you support when we support and uplift one another. As student council president, I will encourage collaboration among different grade levels, clubs, and organizations. Let's celebrate our achievements together, embark on shared projects, and build a genuine sense of belonging in our school community. My fellow students, the choice is yours. Together we can forge a future of our school that is brighter, more inclusive, and supportive of every student's aspirations. I humbly ask for your vote and your trust to, to let me serve you as your student council president. Together we will lead, inspire, and bring about positive change. Thank you and let us embark on this amazing journey together. Now you may go. All right, those are some top choices. So if you are a representative, be thinking about your speeches. They'll come around after fall break. Um, and we will be voting on Thursday, correct?